Oh, fuck. I didn't see you there. I still can't fucking see you there. That was so fucking gay. <laughs> what is up, ladies and gentle titties? This is weird as fuck because usually I'm looking at my ugly ass face when I'm talking to you, but right now I'm looking at the Call of Duty Infinite Warfare multiplayer menu screen. Uh, yes, I'm max level because I'm a fucking no life. But today I decided to play Infinite Warfare on the VR. Now, it is not, you know, VR compatible, but I can still see it in the VR and it's fucking sick. Will I play Call of Duty on the VR? more than once probably fucking not i'm strictly only doing this for the video just and, and to try it out honestly because it is pretty fucking cool if i can explain what i see right now if you know you're in like the movie theater it's a really dark ass room and then you just see the fucking screen down the below that's basically what i see right now everywhere around me is black and then i just see a floating screen just right in front of me it's like i'm at the movie theaters and the screen is fucking huge bro it literally feels like i am playing on a movie theater screen right now what you guys see on video i think is exactly the same as you would see if I would make like a normal video. We're gonna go ahead, we're gonna play a game with this, and then I'm going to try to get on the screen like exactly what I see with the black background or anything. I don't know if it's possible, but I know I've got it on sometimes, but it was, I was playing with like an actual VR game. I don't know. We'll see. This is actually really fucking sick. I wanna- Wow. Oh my god. I wanna try and quick scope like this. This is actually pretty fucking cool. I'm not gonna lie. It's blurry as shit. Let's go, bitch. It's really blurry, but when you're playing a game that isn't, like, VR compatible, it's gonna be blurry. There's a lot of words that are blurry unless you look, like, right at them. That's just the way the VR is. Obviously, if you want, like, perfect graphics, the graphics are still pretty fucking good, but like I said, you have to be, like, looking right on. Like, I'm, I'm looking in the middle right now, and the minimap is blurry if I, like, move my eyes, so I have to physically look at the minimap to make it, like, clear HD 1080p. This is probably, like, the weirdest cutcom I've ever done in my life, and I haven't done a cutcom in so fucking long. I'm like I scared the shit out of me. First ever Call of Duty Infinite Warfare PlayStation VR Cutcom. Probably a first ever PlayStation VR Cutcom. I'm not gonna lie. What fucking retard would do a fucking PlayStation VR Cutcom? Come on, let's be real here. Imagine Call of Duty actually being like VR compat. Oh my god, I'm so bad. Imagine Call of Duty actually being like VR compatible, where I can physically like turn around all the time and see where I am. Obviously, it'd be hard as shit, because I wouldn't be using the analog sticks to look around. I'd be using my actual face. Like, even me bobbing my head here, the screen is moving, so it's fucked up a little bit. Like, it's really hard for me to play this. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna switch to a Karma here, because I am 2 and 7. This is not good, boys. I want to see if I can actually go positive my first game playing with a VR. And the weirdest part about using a VR, there could be somebody, like, hovering over me right now, like my dad or something, my mom just watching me right now. I have no fucking idea, because I cannot see out of the game. That is the great part of about VR, you cannot fucking see shit out of the game. It actually feels like you're in the game when you're playing a VR compatible game. There were times where I forgot which fuck what was real and what was not real. I might even double upload this video today. I went and played Drive Club and I was inside a Pagani Hayura and I tried to adjust my chair and I went to go grab the fucking chair in the game. Like I tried to get the adjuster in the fucking game, in the actual car. I forgot that I wasn't in the car. I gotta stop moving my head. It's making me fucking dizzy, bro. <laughs> Holy shit, these guys are getting fucking smacked. They don't think I'm using a VR. I'm using a VR, bro. Fuck you. Oh my god, this is kind of fucking with my eyes a little bit. I'm not gonna lie, bro. The blurriness, my eyes are already fucked. What the blurriness is like is like I'm not wearing any glasses. It's fucked. What am I? 7 and 13? I'm not doing too bad. I'm not doing too bad at all. <gasps> Oh my god! I forgot that the mic switches to the VR headset! Bro, I was talking in-game that whole fucking time! I'm a fucking idiot! Oh no! I'm so fucking embarrassed right now! What the fuck? I heard myself through that guy's mic and I'm like, wait, what? And he fucking replied to me, oh my god. When you use the VR, it switches the microphone. Oh, fuck me in the asshole. It still uses my Astro- Oh, that was bad. It still uses my Astros at sound, but it fucking switched to the VR. My team was listening to me the whole fucking time. Oh, that's so embarrassing. Fuck me in the ass. I'm sweating now, bro. Why? Why? That's bullshit. All right, so now my mic is muted. Now I don't have to worry about- That's fucking embarrassing. I'm such a fucking retard. Suck my motherfucking penis. Did I only get one? I think I got an assist there. I'm not too sure, but I fucked this bitch up. That's what I did. Any other bitches in here that I'm gonna fuck up? Nope. All right, I'll just go fuck myself. All right, we're gonna use the equalizer here. Hopefully, I can get a couple kills. He took my kill. All right, I'll just go fuck myself. I want to get a kill with this. I love this thing. It's OP as shit. Bang, bang. 
Let's go. How many more are we gonna get? We got a UAV now. Let's fuck this motherfucker up. All right, we got a UAV ourselves. Let's fuck this motherfucker up. Oh god damn it! How did I kill him? Fuck me in the bum! Jesus Christ! Are they taking A? I can't see. Yes, it says losing. Not anymore, motherfuckers. Oh, wait, they took it. Shit. Bang, bang, motherfucker. We're gonna get another guy here. Let's go. Oh, if I turned on that guy, that would have been mental. That would have been absolutely mental. Ooh, random frag. Let's go. Let's fucking go, bro. Let's fucking go. Stop jumping up in the air like a fucking kangaroo. This is not advanced warfare, bitch. You're getting melted. All right, all right. I, I brought it to positive. 27, 26. Make sure our mic is muted. Yep, I'm not talking. This is actually fuck with my eyes. I don't recommend. If you have a VR, I do not recommend playing more than one game of Call of Duty with this thing because I am fucked up right now. What we're gonna do now is try to get you guys to see what I see. Fuck, it's hot in here. Alright, so I couldn't get it to work as soon as I went back into Call of Duty. It just fucked off to the regular screen. So this is basically what I see in VR right now, I can look all around it. This is fucking sick, bro. I, I haven't used the VR in a long time, so it's pretty fucking sick being back in the VR world. It's literally a completely different world. Whenever I turn my head, you can, you can just fucking see all around you. It's 360. So basically, and you can see the controller in the game. I don't know if you can actually see it on screen, but I'm holding the controller up, and I, I can fucking turn it around and shit. It's just a little bit glitchy in this for some reason. In like actual games, it's not glitchy. But basically what I see, look, I'll pull in the menu here. I'm pretty sure you can see the menu moving around and shit. Uh, it, it should be stationary in the middle and then just black all around me. Just like a movie theater screen. Uh, it could be just fucking going crazy all over for you. Like whenever I move my head, the screen moves. I don't know how the fuck you, it is because I can only see what I see. You know what I mean? I can't see the actual screen. So uh, that's basically it. Call of Duty Infinite Warfare in VR. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh, I'll see you all in the next one.